Gray Atkins will receive quite the blow in EastEnders scenes airing later this month. The Albert Square villain, played by Toby Alexander-Smith, will confide in Whitney, Shona McGarty, about his dad passing away. Surprised by the emotional toll of wading through his childhood memories, the two get close and share a kiss. The notorious neighborhood killer, who has previously murdered three Walford favorites, including his own wife Chantelle, Jessica Plummer, who died last year as part of a domestic abuse storyline, will receive quite the curveball with this news. Earlier episodes already saw the pair warming to each other after Whitney believed Gray to be a hero for saving Kirat from the fire at the Mitchells. Speaking to Digital Spy in August, EastEnders boss Kate Oates said Gray's story was always intended to be a longer arc following Chantel's death. She continued, but even though some of his actions have been extreme, they have always been grounded in the roots of Gray's character. H is a classic narcissist, everything he does is designed to fit a narrative that absolves him from guilt, and paints him out to be a good guy. She added, I think in Grey, we have a character who tells himself that Chantel died in a terrible accident, that Tina had to die so he could be there for his kids, and Kush had to go, because he and Whitney are meant to be. H is the center of his own universe, and nothing is his fault. EastEnders boss John Sen also added that Gray's story arc has been winding but necessary to fill out any holes in his history. We're building to the kind of culmination of the Gray storyline, he said back in August. And that takes its kind of next chapter, I think, obviously, has been a very long story arc and it's taken many twists and turns, but we are kind of like you know, going back to the grassroots of the story really pivoting it back to, to its origins, and it's gonna be fascinating turn of events for the Atkins family.